Hi, my name is Dr. Jay Amrish Desai and I welcome you all to my YouTube channel Explore Materials and Metallurgy with Dr. Jay Desai. In today's video, I am talking about a new online training course on physical metallurgy which I have uploaded in the platform Every End. And the basic idea behind this course came from uh, all the viewers of my YouTube channel that they wanted a specific course where they can relate the different concepts of physical metallurgy with actual practical applications. There were concerns that uh, they know the theory, they know the different theoretical concepts, but many people were not able to relate those concepts to the practical reality. And this online training course on physical metallurgy is an attempt to relate the theory with practice. So, what is every end? So, every end is an ecosystem which creates opportunities to learn, earn and grow. So, they basically provide a, a common online platform for service users as well as service providers. And different professionals, different company representatives, different students, they can use this platform to execute engineering projects, to learn engineering and technical subjects, to improve the soft skills that boost careers, to gain and share engineering knowledge, to participate in group discussion on engineering topics, and to browse through different engineering seminars, webinars, and conferences. So it's a one platform for many activities and it is dedicated to engineering. These are the different uh, features which every end has and you can explore to get maximized value for your skills and ability. There is project end where you can post your engineering requirements and assign to an expert for timely execution and delivery. There is learn end where you can enroll into technical courses on core engineering topics offered by gurus to enhance knowledge. There is Mentor Edge, which uh, is basically dedicated to connecting mentors with uh, students and learners who can help in professionals to build their own inherent skills to grow. Then there is No Edge, where you can uh, see different articles based on engineering. And if you are keen, you can also write articles based on engineering. There is, there is a platform called Seminar Eng, in which you can publish your webinar or you can see different seminars, different engineering conferences. And at the last or at the end, we also have Community Eng, which focuses on group discussion on engineering topics. I particularly am active in No Eng, Learn Eng, and Community Eng. So you can reach out to me via these three platforms. Now, why every edge? So I choose every edge because it's a platform where, which is completely dedicated to core engineering community. It gives multiple opportunities in one single ecosystem. And when we use every end, we are basically exposing ourselves to a multinational and global exposure. So there is audience from all over the world. We can reach out, we can share our knowledge, our, uh, our learnings to people from across the world. And here there are also well experienced industry professionals and subject matter experts who take different courses to enhance your skills and to impart different kinds of knowledge and experience. And every end is, a, is special for me because it is focused on value-based courses. The courses price are uh, to the point, they are not too low, they're not too high, they're reasonable and affordable for all. So my motivation of having a course on every end is 
simple, practical and affordable learning for all. And I also want to have a separate doubt solving and open discussions. And through all of this, I want to connect theory with practice and to help in making better engineers and better scientists in the field of metallurgical and materials engineering. So to access, you can visit the, the link which is there over here and you can log in using your Gmail or link, LinkedIn ID and you can select the learn end and then you go to click on enroll courses. In the search bar, you can type physical metallurgy and you can select a module which you are interested in and you can pay and enroll. And, uh, Complete payment is done using all available options. Now, what is there? What all modules I have uploaded in my in uh, my platform, or uh, what all courses I have offered in every engine? So the first module is on bonding in materials. So here, the learning benefits are that you will be able to understand why and how elements they form bonds and the reasons behind the bond formation. Also, you will be able to differentiate among ionic, covalent, metallic and water wall forces. And you can also learn and understand the bonding curves and forces associated with them. So by this, you will be able to see why a particular metal or why a particular alloy is behaving differently and and this bonding how it affects its usage is practical applications and that is this is the first module bonding in materials which is on september 8 thursday and there are two slots one is 12 pm to 1 pm and the repeat is 7 pm to 8 pm so people who are not able to attend the classes from 12 p.m. to 1 p.m., they can attend the same at 7 p.m. to 8 p.m. also. The second module is on crystal structures. Here, the focus is on understanding the concept and importance of unit cells and crystal systems, visualizing different crystal structures and see how they affect the properties and applications of materials, and differentiate between simple cubic, PCC, face centered and HCP systems using different parameters like atom, atoms present, coordination number and atomic factor. This will be on Thursday, 15 September, 12 p.m. to 1 p.m. and 7 p.m. to 8 p.m. Please also note that there will be a separate session for each module. If the time ends, if the time uh, is exceeded, we will have a separate section where we can have a group discussion on uh, doubts or a particular idea. The third module is on point and line defects. Here, the focus is to understand various routes by which point defects are introduced into metals and alloys and how they affect the materials properties and hence its applications. We will also see the cause and usefulness of line defects, the and we will be able to differentiate between vacancy, substitution defect, and interstitial defect. Also, we will be able to differentiate between S screw and mixed dislocation, and how these dislocations they are having its own practical relevance. This is on Thursday, again the same timings: 12 p.m. to 1 p.m., 7 p.m. to 8 p.m. Thursday, 22nd September 2022. The fourth module is on slip systems and surface defects. Here you will learn the reason behind the movement of dislocations. So dislocations basically are the reasons why the materials deform. And we will talk about why the dislocations move in the first place, in which directions, in which planes, in which systems dislocations move, which we call as slip, slip directions, slip planes, and slip systems. And we will Analyze the reasons behind the deformation behavior of PCC, FCC, and SCP structures. Also, the learners will have an understanding behind the reasons causing different surface defects, 
and how this surface defects they impact the material properties this is on 29 september the timings are 12 pm to 1 pm and 7 pm to 8 pm so there are flexible slots the fifth module is construction and interpretation of phase diagrams here you will learn to construct different phase diagrams of different binary alloys and how you can use the phase diagram to predict the performance of an alloy and you will also be able to understand the meaning and significance of phases and phase diagrams and clearly differentiate among terms like solidity limit solid solution solid as temperature liquid as temperature phase diagrams and liver this will be on thursday october 6 2022 12 pm to 1 pm 7 and 7 pm to 8 pm the sixth module is an iron iron carbide phase diagrams here you will be able to visualize the iron iron carbide phase diagram this is the most underrated phase diagram because a uh, lot there is a lot of things which is there in the iron iron carbide phase diagram which is often neglected by uh, many professionals so the goal is the can we have a good understanding of the iron iron carbide phase diagram and the learners can visualize how the iron iron carbide phase diagram looks like and how the temperature affects the formation of various phases in this two component system also the learners they will able to differentiate between phases based on the structure and properties and we will also talk about different reactions like eutectic eutectoid peritectic and how these reactions they affect the iron iron, iron carbide system and how these reactions form different phases and how the formation of different phases leads to applications in certain areas. This is 13th October, 12 p.m. to 1 p.m. and 7 p.m. to 8 p.m. The seventh module is on heat treatment of steels. The learning benefits is understanding the meaning and need of annealing and other heat treatment methods. The learners will also be able to differentiate between various types of annealing and their likely scenarios. Also, the learners will understand what actually happens in the annealing and why these three stages, the recovery, recrystallization and grain growth occur in a material and what does they do to the material and its applications. And we'll also talk about different treatments like annealing, normalizing, hardening, and when they are intended to use. This is on 20 October, 12 p.m. to 1 p.m., 7 p.m. to 8 p.m. The last module is on solidification in metals and alloys. Here, the learners will understand the nucleation process when the liquid is cooled at or below the melting point what actually happens at melting point and what is the driving force behind the formation of solid. The learners will also be able to differentiate between homogeneous and heterogeneous nucleation and different scenarios in which they occur. Here you can relate the theoretical understanding with practice and real life scenarios. This will be on 27th October, Thursday, 12 p.m. to 1 p.m. and 7 p.m. to 8 p.m. Now, who should attend? So, university students who aim for a career in metallurgical materials, mechanical engineering, and are curious to familiarize themselves with a basic understanding of why different metals or alloys behave differently. Experienced engineers and scientists can also attend these courses. It will have a quick recap on fundamentals of metals and alloys, their structures, and heat treatment processes. And anyone, irrespective of department, who is fascinated to learn, visualize, and analyze different materials and their performance. And since I want this subject 
to be as easy as possible as simple as possible and as affordable as possible to people to students to professionals across the world the per module price is as low as only 1 pound that is only rupees 96 for indian uh, learners so that it is affordable and at the same time there is some effective learning it is not just theory courses it is the focus will be on how we can relate the theory to the practical applications how the science can help us in designing better processes and better methods if you have any suggestions or queries on the content or if you have any possible openings or you would like to collaborate with me on uh, anything you can reach out to me on my linkedin page um, my email address or by commenting on any of my youtube video thank you and uh, i wish to see you all in my platform in my courses and i look forward to discussing topics on metallurgy and materials engineering with you all thank you